closed her eyes that were still open. They hid her face with a white linen. And some sobbing, others in silence, from the sad bedroom all came away. The night light in a disc burned on the floor. It threw on the wall the bed's shadows. One saw sometime drawn in sharp line the body's shape. The dawn appeared at its first whiteness with its thousand noises the town awoke before the contrast of light and darkness of light and strangeness I thought a moment my God how lonely the dead are over the shoulders of men to church they bore her and in a chapel they left her by her there they surrounded her pale body with yellow candles and black stuff. At the last stroke of the ringing for the souls, an old crone finished her last prayers. She crossed the narrow nave, the doors moaned, and the holy place remained deserted. From a dark, from a clock one heard, the measured ticking, and from a candle, the guttering. All things there were so dark and mournful, so old, cold and rigid, that I thought a moment, my God, how lonely the dead are. From the high belfry, the tongue of iron, to leave the dead so wretched and alone.